Hello everyone and welcome to Don Amots. My name's Adam and today I'm going to be showing you around one of our latest arrivals. It's a 2021 Bailey Autograph 74.4. So it's four travelling, four sleeping. It weighs up to three and a half ton maximum so you can drive it on a standard UK licence. It's a 2.2, 165 brake horsepower and it's covered just over 7,000 miles. So let's have a look around, see what we've got. So it's the newer shape Autograph. Uh, so you've got the black cab, we've got the alloy wheels, Solar panel you can see just up there as standard on these. Um, moving around, you've got your electrical hookup point on the side just here. Gas locker, there's room for two six kilo bottles in there and your water fill point is just there. Fridge and freeze vents and your toilet cassette lives just in there. Round onto the back, you do have a reverse camera, just displays on the screen on the dash which I'll show you on the inside and you've got fitting should you want to add a bike rack to this as well. Onto the passenger side, we'll start at the top, you've got your fuel wind out canopy, we've got the vent for your Aldi heating, so you've got the wet central heating system on this one, and it has a French bed which we'll see on the inside, so loads of storage under there, um, which you can see from the inside or the outside. Yeah. Let's drop that back down. Alloy wheels again. We've got your gas barbecue points. You don't need to mess about with your bottles on the other side. Just hook your barbecue straight up to there. External socket, just there. So if you want power outside under your awning, you just plug straight in. And your diesel point is just here with add blue. So let's have a look on the inside. Awning light above the door. You've got bin, fly screen and blind on the door as well. Coming in Wendy. We'll go down towards the cab. So you've got a nice spacious lounge area. You've got two captain's chairs, they both swivel. We'll go down towards the cab first. Being the Bailey Autograph range, they're all uh, manual, so it's a six speed manual gearbox. You've got cruise control, your sat nav and your reverse camera come through on the screen in the centre just there. We've got cab air conditioning, USB and power points. We do have cab blinds on your windscreen and your driver and passenger door. So you don't need to mess around with any silver screens or anything like that. Yeah. Big skylight letting in loads of light above Wendy. Yeah. Your extra travelling belts are just here. So you've got driver and passenger seat and then your two other passengers just here. Section here just lifts out with this cushion for travelling. So you can get your legs down nicely. This does turn into a big double bed. I have just made it up before the video. So Wendy's going to put a picture on. If you look through the pictures, you'll see this made up as a bed as well. Usually it's a couple of tables. It's really easy to do. I'm happy to demonstrate that for you and at the top here big storage locker tv aerial and your booster is just in the corner just there and then big locker on the other side as well you've got your solar charger in the top corner yeah. loads of literature all your all your books and everything water hoses all in there mind the step on the way down into the kitchen so we'll start on this side you've got your microwave at the top all built in storage up here and then here's a control panel for your Aldi heating plenty of plug sockets for kettle toast or anything like that light switches really nice splash back on all the blinds you on all the windows sorry you've got blinds and fly screens yep. that's all the way around the van nice big sink and then the top of your cooker hob this lifts down so you've got extra work surface space and then when you do want to use it you've got the full works on this one you've got three ring gas hob one electric plate separate grill separate oven loads of storage all the way around all soft closed drawers as well so you just push them in and they close nice deep drawers let me just pop that down before we forget over onto the other side you've got your main control panel for the van little storage pocket there more storage up here and you have a tv point here as well so light switches tv point there and your aerial points there um, and then in here more storage Further down, you've got your wardrobe. You've got one of your tables in here with your Aldi fluid, hanging rail there as well. I'll show you the table in a minute. Mm -hmm. Part of the kitchen that I did miss out is your tall fridge and freezer compartment. So it's your three-way, it runs off gas, electric, uh, or you do have a travel mode as well. Freezer compartment at the top there. Get everything you need in there. And then up at the top, another storage locker and another one further down as well. Into the bedroom area, you can shut this off. There is a blind that comes all the way across. If you've got guests in the front, you can pull it over. 
You've got storage all the way around, three big storage lockers, skylight above the bed as well. And then underneath the bed, I'll just lift this up for you. So it's the other side of the locker that we saw on the inside. You've got your boiler over there. Here's your main table, so it's freestanding and it does become part of your bed. There's the infill cushions for your bed under there and your wind out awning uh, pole just there as well. And then down into the bathroom, you've got full size separate shower. You've got your sink, loads of storage, your toilet as well. And storage above the toilet next to the mirror. It's nice having a separate shower cubicle. So it's really, really nice van. It's just arrived with us. It's in really nice condition. Um, you can drive it on a standard license. It's low mileage. If you do have any questions, please give me a call. My name's Adam and I'm more than happy to help. Thank you.